Hi guys, my name is Zorin and I'm from the Braxo team. I would like to present our new project for you. Audio Jungle. This is editable template, where you can change the text, insert your image and use your logo. When you download that project from VideoHive, you will have several folders. In folders motion graphics you will have file that you will import into Premiere Pro. In this project we have added the After Effects folder, so now you can optionally use the After Effects as well. This folder contains an extension that will help you add your media files into Premiere Pro. The help folders contains all necessary video instructions and links, which will help you use and customize this project. Open that readme file. First of all you will need to download this installer, so use that link to download this installer. And there you can choose platform which you use, so you can download for Windows or for Mac. When you install this installer to your computer, you will need just drag and drop this file into this installer. After that you will need to restart your Adobe application. Now open Premiere Pro and choose Windows Essential Graphics. And you will need open that extension which you just installed to your Premiere Pro. Here, MoGraph tool. And now you will need import that template into your Essential Graphics. So open Essential Graphics and here, right corner, you will have that button. Press this button and open that folder which you download from VideoHive. There you will have that motion graphic templates and choose that MoGraph which you download from VideoHive. To found that project in your Essential Graphics, start type name of this project here. And now create new sequence. And just drag and drop these templates into your timeline. Change second setting if you need. To edit image into that project you will need use a MoGraph tools. So choose this template and open MoGraph tool. Here press let's go. And here you will have all placeholders where you can upload your image. Remember, you should use PNG image. In folder help, in readme file, you will have link to online service which help you to convert your image to PNG. And now use that placeholder to upload your image into that project. Here intro logo and final logo and image number 1 until image number 22. When you fill all placeholders with your content, you will need to play a couple of times this project to clean Premiere Pro cache. And now, when all your photo appear in this project, you can edit image size of these pictures. So open Essential, choose this project and open Essential Graphics. Here you will have that button Edit. And you will have that folder Edit Image. Open this folder. And here you will have all parameters which help you customize image in this project. So that's image number three. I can change size of that image. And move this image by position. Same way I can customize logo into that project. So intro logo here I will have that parameter scale. I can change scale and can move that logo by position. Same way logo outro. In folder edit color you will have all color controls which help you to customize color into this project. Here you will have color controls for text. You can change color of your background and customize that tint. To edit color of this text, use this text number one. 
In folder Edit Logo and Title, you can customize your title or intro logo. Here you will have that checkbox, so you can choose, uh, you will use your logo or switch to title. You can type your text here, you can change font of your title here. And if you use your logo, you can change color of your logo here. Same way you can customize final logo. So you will have that checkbox, you can switch to title or just uh, use your logo and here you can change color of your logo. In folder edit subtitles you can edit your subtitles. You can type your text here, you can change color of your subtitles there and uh, here you will have that parameter which help you to change size of your subtitle and position if you need. In folder edit text you will have all parameters which help you to customize text in this project. Here you can type your text, change size and position of this text. So for example, uh, I will type my text here. Change size. And move this text by position. That parameter will help you to move background text. That's all. Now just add your sound into this project and you will ready to render this amazing intro. Check our readme file, there you can find link to sound which we use in preview. Optionally you can change fonts in this project. For change fonts you will need open this project in After Effects. In folder which you download from Video Hive, you will have that folder After Effect. So just open this folder and open that file in After Effect. When you open this project in After Effect, you will have that folder edit here. In that folder, you will have that composition main comp. When you open this main comp, you will have all text layer where you can change your fonts. So choose all text layer and choose fonts which you would like to use in this project. And now you will need export this motion graphic templates. So right button in main comp and open this project in essential graphics. Here you can find all parameters which you can customize and that button export motion graphic template. And here choose local templates folder to save this project in your Premiere Pro directly. Press OK. Optionally you can customize this project in After Effects. So uh, here in edit here folder you will have that folder with placeholders. You can upload your image and uh, pictures in that placeholders. Just open that comp, import your content into After Effects and just drag and drop your media into this placeholders. All controllers you can find in Essential Graphics. So right button open in Essential Graphics. And here you will have all controllers which will help you to customize this project. You can change color, you can work with your logo, and you can type your text directly here. Or you can use main comp to edit your text. Here you will have all text layer which will help you to do this. If you finish your customization in After Effects, just render this project from After Effects. Thank you for your attention. If you have any question or suggestion on this project, you can write to us using our mail. Just use the Envata form. Our team will be grateful for your positive feedback. You can leave your feedback in the download section in the menu of your personal account on Envata. More information about this project as well as the download link can be found in the description below this video. Braxo team.